campaign 2020 with election day now only 15 days off in person. Early voting is now happening across South Florida and by the looks of the long lines, voters are not wasting any time to make sure they cast their ballots. Dozens of early voting locations are available from Broward to Miami Dade to Monroe County with a record number of voters expected to come out. Election officials say they are ready for the crowds. CBS 4's Brooke Schaefer kicks off our live team coverage in North Miami with a look at how things are going there. Brooke. Hey, Francis, good afternoon. The supervisor of elections in Miami Dade said she expects about 80% voter turnout for this presidential election. And you can already see those record numbers and long lines. If you walk with us for a little bit here in North Miami, this line at the public library stretches down the block and even around the corner. Eager voters waiting as long as it takes to cast their ballot. Before the sun came up Monday, Lydia Silva and her husband were in line outside Miami-Dade election headquarters. A five, we have five. We don't want to wait, and then the crowd and the people. One of in-person early voting didn't damper voter excitement. We saw long lines from headquarters in Doral to the Coral Gables Public Library. I can't believe I'm doing this. Be honest with you, to wait in line for an hour. And here in North Miami, we waited just about 90 minutes. Marie Fatil cast her ballot at the North Miami Public Library early Monday. I know some people, you know, prefer the mail in ballot, but I think it's just that serious of an election that if I can come in person, I, I did so. We've started off qu quite busy as we expected for a presidential election, and we have over 8,000 people that already voted in the first couple of hours. Miami-Dade Supervisor of Elections Christina White called it a record-setting turnout. The lines at sites across the county even joined by a little Miami flair. Voters in Miami-Dade can go to any of the county's 33 early voting sites. They'll be open from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. from today until November 1st. You'll need to bring your mask and hand sanitizer will be there. And if you have a vote by mail ballot, you can also drop it off in person at any of the early voting locations. The message now from fellow voters, come out early and come prepared. Be prepared, bring water, bring your chair and come out and vote. Now, if you haven't requested a vote by mail ballot and you want to do that, you have until October 24th to request a vote by mail ballot. Now, if you're worried about these long lines, the county does have a website where you can check those wait times. We've posted that for you on our website, CBSMiami.com. I am live in North Miami, Brooke Schaefer, CBS4 News.